deadly tornado swept through a Clyde Township campground near Port Huron. The tornado came without warning. RVs were tossed around and ripped to shreds. Families returned to their site to gather some of their belongings. Jeff Johnson was one of the injured campers. Tonight, he's in the hospital with a punctured lung and fractured ribs. His wife, who was not at the campground when the tornado blew through, talked to our Anu Prakash from the hospital. Jeff is uh, doing very well, um, other than the emotional uh, loss with Jim Anderson. That's the big, the big concern here. Uh, we're all okay, and uh, we're just very extremely saddened by his loss. Your husband and but Mr. Anderson were very close? Jim was Jeff's surrogate father. He, he's known Jim his whole life and uh, they were very, very close. What has your husband been able to tell you about what happened yesterday? The way that Jeff explains it to me, uh, the storm just came out of nowhere, just like any other day, any other Sunday. Jim and, and our friend Cliff and Jeff were sitting under Cliff's awning, and all of a sudden the wind came up, and the trailer started moving, and Jeff, you know, pushed Cliff and, and Jim to the ground, and the camper just rolled on top of them, and continue to roll and tussle while our other two friends were inside. I can't believe that's my camper in the middle of the lake, and I can't believe that, you know, there were no other fatalities. You can see the Red Cross here helping out anyone in need. Meantime, Jeff Johnson is one of three people still hospitalized tonight. We're told all of them are in fair condition. In Clyde Township, I'm Anu Prakash, Channel 7 Action News. The National Weather Service